Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing Amber Sandalwood by Revlon Sense Blends. Um, overall, I thought this was okay. I kept wavering between okay and liking it. Um, I think I'm going to settle on it's okay. This has a very dry, sweet, leathery, woody, incense-y um, smell to it. Um, the top notes are bergamot and juicy pear. I would agree with uh, the pear. The bergamot is very faint. Um, the citrus in this, it's not very strong. The middle notes are violet leaf and iris mix. And I'm guessing those two is what I'm smelling that I don't like. Um, overall, when I smell those two, like prominently in perfumes, I tend not to like it. Sandalwood and cedarwood, I would agree. Um, you can smell that. Um... This is supposed to be a unisex smell, just like in the other review that I did with Honeysuckle and Jasmine. And this one, I can imagine being um, unisex. Um, I don't know. I don't know what else to say about this. It was, it was okay. I felt like, um, I felt like I've smelled this in other perfumes, but it was done better. There's a lot of perfumes I've smelled that kind of have like a dry, sweet, leathery, you know, smell. And I, I can't, of course, recall any of them off the top of my head, but I do remember, I do know that I preferred the other ones to this one. It's not a bad perfume. It's just, um, I'm not a big fan of Violet Leaf and Iris, um, and Iris, I guess I should stop saying Iris Mix, whatever that is. But, um, would I buy this again? No, definitely not. I would probably give this as a gift to... A very young person. Um, that's all I have. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.